7.5, XL low, 825, Jen and Steve in the morning. We are so excited. That music can only mean one thing. Tiffany! Tiffany's here! Hello. Hi, good morning. Good morning. I can tell already, you're so much fun, Tiffany. Oh, well, We've thank you. We've been having a blast just talking to you off air a little bit. And you're performing tonight at our awesome 80s prom. We were just kind of warning you about the crowd. I mean, people go all out for this thing. I'm excited. You've traveled the globe. You've been you've been doing your thing for some time. I'm confident nothing that you've done could have prepared you for what you're about to witness today. <laughs> all right, bring it on. <laughs> 1,600 people, grown grown people, grown ups, dressed yeah. like Papa Smurf. Well, yeah. You know, I mean, I'm going to have to find a mall before I, before the show. That's well, you're, you're, you're Tiffany. That, right? I'm that totally, works. Exactly. I'm <laughs> Tiffany. I have to yeah. do that and I have a mean shopping habit. Yeah. But, I mean, in the 80s, I never dressed up. If you remember, it was just jeans and a t-shirt and... Big hair and hoop earrings. So I'm gonna have Friday. to bring it tonight. I'm gonna have to dress a well, little. Well, people expect that when you 80s. go out and do '80s shows, right? That you're gonna dress. 80s. And I'm gonna dress it. And I'm always like, guys, I never this really. Is it. This right. is dressed up for me. I'm in a sparkly dress and heels now. I've really grown up. <laughs> you come at a, an opportune time, Tiffany, because the the residents of this part of the country are filled with uh, fright and anxiety. The Boston Red Sox, horrible. They're doing horrible. <laughs> They've what, won one game? They've won one game. They've yeah. lost five. I'm showing you my blank. This oh, this is what? I, was, I got excited. No. I saw you bringing it out of the package, and I was like, oh, it took my I got that away. for us. So if... if oh, flip the medallion around. If though. they win, Tiffany, I, I don't know what you packed when you came in. You just arrived most of yesterday. If they win today, <laughs> and you're here, you can't leave. Right. Because oh, you're you the of that. And then uh, we will have That's the That's a lot of pressure. Well, we have a lot of malls. Oh, I'm in. I'm <laughs> yeah. good. I can, I can rearrange so, things. Right. <laughs> when you kicked uh, off the mall tour uh, back in the 80s, what was the first mall that you were at? Do you remember? Uh, uh, Bergen Mall. The Bergen Mall in New, in New Jersey. Jersey. Okay. And so what was that like? Just how that all came together. Well, and you're on top. No, but I'm saying <laughs> just being on the top of the world at that moment. Well, you know, I mean, being, let's see. 14 when I recorded the album. I just wanted to sing. So to actually be in recording, I didn't know any of that kind of stuff, the business stuff. I was always in my bedroom, twirling around, wanting to be Stevie Nicks is really who I wanted to be, um, in front of a band and all the cool costumes. So to be in a mall, you know, with kids screaming and a lot of times like older women screaming at me. To well, because shut of what, up. what yeah, you were yeah. doing to their kids. Right, right. So. Well, a, a lot of storefront owners did not know I was coming. So I would, he would set up our little, you know, set up there, sure, our right. little stage, and, and then we would push play, and I would be out there dancing and do my thing, and people that own jewelry stores or... That are like, trying to conduct business. They would scream and yell. I, I cried a couple of times. Oh, my but, gosh. But, you know, I was, you're much more resilient when you're a kid. I was, like, right. cried for, like, 15 minutes, and I was like, okay, great, so we do it again in 15? Right, great. Yeah. <laughs> and I could go and have pizza after and Cause you're at the meet floor everybody. Court. Yeah, beautiful. it was great. It really was great. But then taking that outside of the you know United States and going to other countries and hearing people scream my name, I mean, it got bigger than I ever, ever imagined. Well, and it, really? felt, it feels amazing. Well, Steve and I were talking about it. It really was brilliant marketing to do that at the mall because it was already a haunt for these right. young girls. We were already at the mall shopping. And Plus, that's where I hung out. Plus, right. it's, a, it's a hook because there's good singers all over the place that don't get a break or don't have right. any kind of a hook. And now... Even 25 years later, Tiffany, mall, done. I remember. Yeah. All yeah. of the well, world. It was actually done, and mall, mall tour was actually done out of desperation to keep me on the, on the really? label because they were going to drop me. The backstory is they had put me in clubs, and people loved the music, but I was 15. Right. So I couldn't really be in the club, and I could not relate and your crowd to the crowd at all. You know, I was just a kid. So, you know, the labels kind of was rethinking the, the strategy and thought, well, I just, I think this isn't going to work and we're probably going to drop her. We got wind of it, my manager and I, and um, Larry Salter's over at MCA, and oh, desperately Larry. he put together, he was like, where do kids hang out that it would make sense? And, if it's, and it's cheap and they'll go for it, you know? Perfect. And the food court right told there, me the ball, said, yeah. was all about it, yes. The yeah, time, that's perfect. The time is 8.30. Jen and Steve here with Tiffany. We're going to have Tiffany hang out with that's us. That's Tiffany... 
cancel however you planned the next uh, right. half hour. Right, yeah. <laughs> We're going to make radio gold. We're live in five We days. have delicious She's muffins coming coffee. your way. I'm going to have yeah. a girl, guys. And Eric's Lapidisserie downstairs, the best chocolate chip cookie you've had in your life. Oh. In your life? Yes. How many chocolate chip cookies have you had? Send some of those with you. This on one's way. the best. Well, recently, not a lot. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, we get cookies coming up. Now, to a grown woman, not a lot. Coming so. up, we're going to talk about um, the tour with Debbie Gibson that yes. you did. And um, she recently did The Celebrity Apprentice and find mm -hmm. out some of the other projects you're doing. And you brought us some music I did. as well. So we'll find out what you're doing in that realm as well. Perfect. And All then right. whenever we give away the tickets, is up to you because you're the guest. Oh, so okay. at some time between now and 9 o'clock, you just say sign. call now, and then whoosh, someone right. brings tickets to the prom and to meet you, meet and greet. I'll drink a little oh, more coffee and okay. make it happen. <laughs> I love it.